Hey guys, this is Aaron Brookers, back to you with another video. Today, I'll be showing you my mock of the Slave 1 that Boba Fett owns. So this is my Slave 1 mock. This has been here for quite a while and I thought I'd make a video on this today. As you can see, this is not a mini figure scale at all. So if I put my sig fig right next to it, this is quite huge but not mini figure scale at all. If it was, I would, have been, I would have been able to put this in the cockpit, but it's not, sadly. I don't have enough pieces to do that, but maybe in a future video, I might make my very own huge Slave 1 full interior, like, every, like as much detail as possible. So if you want to see that happening, uh, to comment that in the comment section, and like, if you want to, like, sit support me on patreon for like a euro a month where you can actually just put i didn't know this until now that you can actually put your own donation on you know that is not a monthly subscription so you can just buy like a tenner or like a euro and if you want to just support me but one time payment or if you want to support me daily as a monthly subscription you can support me like over like a euro a month but if you want to get madder you can get 10 you can support me at 10 or 20 so, if you want to see one of these huge models in real life here on our channel, support us on Patreon. So this is my both as I said, Bofet Slave 1. This is okay-ish. I tried to do this for like a 10 second re sculpture, then it just failed horribly. I might re re revisit that. But for now, this is what my slave one looks like. My custom stand. So you can, the winds can the wings can fold up and down like that. It's quite flimsy. It's more of a display model than a play model. So you can just put on like this if you want, or. You can, if you want this to fly, you can just pull it up like this, put the wings out, as if it's flying, and you can swoosh it around if you want. This bit is a tiny bit loose here, and I'll make that, and so I, this, you can see this is not Lego, but uh, this was way back in the time when I barely had anything. So, yeah, I might just take this out and put a proper Lego thing so it's not brick there. But I really enjoyed making this, and this probably will be staying here on the shelf for a longer period of time. If not, I might just break this or like make a, a bit bigger one, maybe a, sm a bit bigger, but also not too huge and minifigure skill. If you want that to happen, comment that in the comment section. I'll see if, what I can do. I made this small stand for the slave one, so that can easily just so you can position it like this if you want, or you can do it as if it's flying. I have the three engines, the three thrusters in the back. Just a bit more detail onto this. So it looks from the top, the front, the sides, and the back. This is quite flimsy, it's only being connected by that one jungle plate. So that's why it just comes out and swings up and down a lot. I really don't. I think this is a very nice mock as of my like, very first micro um, slave one. So yeah, that's my review on my slave one mock. If you're watching this video, please drop a like and please consider to subscribe and, and put your notifications on so you can notify when you make more future content and until then
will see you in the next one.